Girls Riding High. I love this piece. This is really what I look for in a doc. It's that ability to be inspiring and to tackle something that is large scale, which is empowering our, our youth, getting community activity and togetherness happening and, and what that takes. But it's also really deeply intimate as well to that specific community, which is unique in its offerings and we really got a great sense of this group and of all the personalities with the interviews that felt very relaxed and open and honest and yeah getting that true sense of the group of the community and then it was great because it felt like it could be integrated into other places that have those offerings of nature. I just thought this was really well curated, great pacing to the piece. The subjects obviously felt very comfortable and open in sharing, and the cinematography was stunning. We really did get a sense of those great sweeping vistas, what it offers in terms of natural abundance. And there was that real excitement and on the ground action that immersed me into the group. So overall, I was really impressed with this piece and um, I should be really proud of its effect and just really nice professional um, product. Um, I really liked Girls Riding High. Um, I thought it was uh, uh, one like some of the best, one of the best subjects for a documentary I've ever seen. And I always say the documentary rides on the subject matter. When I tell you I was infested, like, this is a beautiful thing that this uh, person is doing um, for the community, for, I think, society. Just, cause, like, she said, she seems to have the best attitude about the whole thing and just, like, executing it super well. It reminded me of when I was in Boy Scouts and, like, some of the experiences that I uh, went through and, like, learned and some of the opportunities that I had because of Scouts, because of the confidence, like how she was saying, building that confidence and, like, just being outdoors and what that's like and how that grows you as a person, especially when you're in that age range. Oh, my goodness. I know that. I know the benefits of that firsthand is what I'm saying. And to see that for girls, I think is a beautiful thing. Like, because I know what it did for me as a boy. I can't imagine. You know what I'm saying? So there's that. Two, B-roll was phenomenal. Like, National Geographic, Netflix ready, theaters ready. Drone shots of the girls, like, um, biking, beautiful. Um, the B-roll, I mean, the the interview, A-roll of her against the background, that shot, beautiful. Um, and then, uh, but uh, even just, like, the stuff she said, I really like what she said, like, building girls' confidence in what they can do with their bodies as opposed to, like, how they imagine their looks of their bodies. I think that, that's a great mindset to, like, instill. I think, uh, and then also, like, how she was saying, like, you can do stuff in your community. You don't have to be a certain age. Like, stuff I learned in Boy Scouts, like, it's going to change the world, I think. Not just these girls' lives, but, like, not just these girls' lives for themselves, but also once these girls grow up and become part and, like, go out into society, it's going to change society. So I think it's dope, man. Great job. <laughs> girls riding high. Mm, I truly loved watching this. It filled me with a sense of uh, empowerment and yeah, definitely made me a bit emotional. I think as all the aspects of it uh, work together to create this truly authentic and genuine feeling of uh, the spirit of adventure and empowerment and passion. So let's start with the incredible landscapes and uh, the cinematography does incredible justice to the settings of Alaska. It creates a stunning backdrop to the story, for the story, uh, and also obviously loved how it features young girls engaging in sports and activities that are often labelled as masculine. It's 
truly it's masculine and also um, adult so it's inspiring to see them challenge these traditional gender roles and embrace their passions fearlessly um the interviews um that are intercut between the landscape um footage offer fascinating insights uh, discussing topics like the importance of appreciating where you come from and also how adrenaline in sports can provide a positive outlet during adolescence. Uh, watching the young girl, the founder, talk about the natural high of risky sports with such enthusiasm and true passion it was very uplifting and mm, I'm so glad you captured that perspective. The film also includes beautiful moments in nature like the bears playing or fighting, uh, which adds a lot of depth and richness to um, the narrative. Um, yeah, this film masterfully intertwines the inspiring stories with breathtaking visuals um, and really encourages uh, the, the whoever is watching this to embrace their interests regardless of societal expectations and fears. So yeah, great job. Girls Riding High, what a lovely documentary. Um, this was a very good piece for many reasons, the main of which is that the production quality is very very good, it's very professional, uh, we get a beautiful look of this amazing place in Alaska, uh, it was a joy getting the chance to travel by it, even if it's just by the images of the video, it was very, very enjoyable experience, but I I think that what compels me the most about this piece was precisely the way these young women find a community in which they can learn to be themselves, they can become more confident, they can become more uh, more secure about their, themselves, and they find a place where they can be vulnerable, they can find womanhood, sisterhood, and, and it's a very enjoyable experience because all of these girls are really excited about this place, they love it, and, and I just I just like it very much what they were saying, I like the idea of this program, uh, I hope, I wish, we had more programs and activities like this in different places of the United States and other parts of the, of the world um, because I think that a program like this can offer a lot of benefits to young women as we, as we saw in this video and yes, overall I think it was a very inspiring piece I really like it, so thanks for singing it 